Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. When was the Supreme Court formed? The formation of the Supreme Court is deeply rooted in the U.S. Constitution. On September 17, 1787, 39 delegates to the Philadelphia Convention signed the U.S. Constitution, which includes Article 3. This article invests the nation's judicial power in one Supreme Court and in such inferior courts as the Congress may from time to time ordain and establish. The Constitution, however, did not provide the detailed organization of the federal judiciary. This was left to the first Congress, which met on March 4, 1789. One of the first items of business for this Congress was to fulfill the requirements of Article 3, Section 1 of the Constitution. On September 24, 1789, President George Washington signed the Judiciary Act of 1789, a legislation that established the framework for the federal judicial system. This act set up a Supreme Court with a Chief Justice and five Associate Justices, and also established 13 District Courts and three Circuit Courts. The Judiciary Act of 1789 was crucial in defining the structure and operations of the Supreme Court. It mandated that the justices would hold their offices during good behavior and receive compensation that would not be diminished during their tenure. The act also required justices to ride circuit, presiding over circuit courts twice a year in their assigned judicial districts. The Supreme Court held its inaugural session from February 2nd through February 10th 1790 at the Royal Exchange in New York City, which was then the U.S. Capitol. John Jay was nominated as the first Chief Justice, and he called the court to assemble for the first time on February 1, 1790. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.